With Naxport Pro, it's all about getting more out of the time you're putting into your analysis. So let's look at data collection. In your tagging window, rather than having a single panel that's got multiple buttons on it, like you have in Scout, in Pro you can have three panels and they can be connected with what we call panel flows. So you might have a main tagging window and when you press something on that, like an attacking opportunity, it flicks to the next panel that you've created. So you can speed up your collection because rather than having everything in one place, you can kind of put your chain and notation into the tagging windows. So click a button, it opens up another panel, make some clicks there. When you click again, it either goes to the third panel or back to the home one. Also, you can have a graphic descriptor on each panel. So now you've got three different pitch elements that you can use to collect more data. The things that I really find powerful with that data collection though is clustered buttons. So rather than having to click every single button to tag it, you can overlay buttons on top of each other so that one click gives you plenty of data. So one click could be turning on four buttons at once. That could be category and a few descriptors or a couple of categories and a couple of different descriptors. The other thing that happens to speed up your work is you can set buttons to be an auto presentation or an auto list. So that at the end of your analysis, you've already put in clips into presentation windows that you need or making lists ready to go through. So lots more ways to get information when you're tagging in Export Pro, but also you can dive into that with more detail. So you're used to having a dashboard that shows you the results for your games. In Pro, you can combine the results from three different timelines into a single dashboard. So now you can see those trends and tendencies over time, see your key stats from three games combined. There's also a clip filter tool so you can find specific categories and descriptors, again combined from three different timelines. So more ways to collect data there, more ways to review it. And a big thing with Pro is if you're doing a live capture, when you're capturing that video, you can rewind it in real time. So you have the live action going on here, you open a delay window, and now you can see the things that have happened. You can tag those, you can go back and review, and you have a lot more ways to impact and review that game live. So Naxport Pro is really, really powerful, a great step up. If you want to collect more data faster, review it in more ways and make an impact on the game, Pro is a great version to look at.